Hello folks, this is 2024 May June paper 1 2 and the question number is 30. And the question is concerned with the chapter curry electricity. It says the diagram shows a cell of negligible internal resistance connected to a switch and two resistors of resistances R and 2R. Switch here, resistors R and 2R here. And we have two emitters as well. The circuit also contains two emitters X and Y, X and Y. The reading on X is 4.0 ampere, 4.0 ampere when the switch is open. So right now, this thing is open <coughs> and at that time uh, Ix is equal to, initially, Ix is equal to 4.0 amperes. What are the readings on X and Y after the switch is closed? So we have to deal with things after the switch is closed. So initially open, what happens is current flows through this path only, through this path only. So I can say that and uh, the resistor, res resistance will be R only. This 2R would not work. So we have this I should be equal to, sorry, we have this, uh, uh, this uh, Ix should be equal to, equal equal to E by this R, E by R. So E is the EMF here. R is the resistance through which current flows. So it should be E by R. So which means it is 4.0 is equal to E by R or vice versa. E by R equal to 4.0. This is something that we should be taking in mind. Now we connect the switch. So when you connect the switch, this uh, twice R also comes into effect. And this emitter also comes into the picture. So first what happens is current comes up to here. Then it divides. It divides. And when it divides, uh, the value of current here will be, uh, uh, let's say, let's do it later. So first let us find the value of this combined resistance, R total. So R total will be equal to twice R into R divided twice R plus R. That's equal to three, sorry, twice R square by three R, uh, which is equal to two R by three. So it is two by three into R. So this R total is equal to two by three into R. Now the new current is, new current in the circuit is Ix is equal to E divided the total resistance which is RT. So that's equal to E by 2 by 3R. That's equal to 3 by 2, then E by R. And that's equal to the value of E by R has been declared as 4.0. So it's equal to, or I can simply say uh, 3 by 2 into ER. So initially it was uh, uh, E by R. Uh, so let's say it is uh, 3 by 2 into 4 equal to 2 to the 4. Uh, to the, to the six. So it is 6 ampere. So uh, this uh, Ix is equal to 6 ampere. 6 ampere. Now what happens is among this 6 ampere it divides into two parts here. Two parts here. And uh, since the resistance here is half, this is twice. This is twice of this thing. So that's why the current going here should be twice of the I. And this should be I. If this is I, the current going here should be twice I because it has got half of the combative resistance. So this resistance is half of this. So that's why current going here should be twice of this. So now that means let's go for this. Our I Y is equal to simply I. Simply I. And uh, this I is equal to this I is equal to one third of this uh, one third of this I X. So I X is uh, I X divides into this and this. 2i i total should be 3i total should be 3i so that's why it's equal to one third of this one third of ix one third of uh, ix it should be that's equal to 1 by 3 into 6 uh, amperes that's equal to 2 amperes so 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 the current here should be 2 amperes and current here should be 6 amperes which uh, makes us choice number c gives the correct choice and all the Three are incorrect.